Hello guys, welcome back. We are in the Lake District. I'm with my family today. First time mum is in the vlog. We've got my mum. We've also got Ruben and his girlfriend as well. And we are at the Park Dean near Windermere. Yeah. Freestyle Friday 14, E double. Good morning, everybody. So just outside the caravan, gonna give it a nice little look. Walking into the caravan, you'd notice it's very spacious. Lots of room to cook and relax and put your feet up. Not that I would stay in the caravan that long because I do like to explore. But because I was on holiday with family, we would make a lot of use of the accommodation. So down the corridor to the bedrooms, the double room where my mum would be staying, a much tidier version of my bedroom at Haggerston Castle. Then the twin rooms, not a lot of space, but it's ideal because we'll only be using it to sleep. Oh, look at this complimentary cup of tea. You know what? Pretty impressed with this caravan, to be fair. My mum seems very impressed, to be fair. Yes, because I've never been to a caravan where we get complimentary cups of tea coffee. Prosecco would have been nice for a barrio. I mean, we're not all inclusive. <laughs> Off to go find a tourist information place, leaving mum in charge of this holiday. But yeah, I would usually look online for what to do, but you know, leave my mum to it. It's her holiday. So <laughs> you've been bloody lazy and you're leaving it all to me. <laughs> so guys, if you can see in the distance, just over there on this little island here, that's where we're staying, at the Park Dean. So after going to the tourist information place, we decided what we were going to do. Hire a boat and set sail along Lake Windermere. The water and scenery was beautiful. It's true what they say. The Lake District is one of the most stunning places in the UK. I think we made the right choice getting our own boat. A much cooler experience than using the ferry. Oh, what a lovely day, actually. I thought it was going to be raining today. It's pretty nice. Enjoying yourself, Mum? Yeah. Ruben taking the wheel since he's been designated driver the whole trip. I decided to have a little go on the wheel. It was pretty nice to be fair. Obviously you gotta not attack the waves, gotta go with the waves. It's quite funny to be fair, because I don't actually drive a car in real life. So getting to drive the boat was a great experience. Gonna learn how to drive in November though. Got a little bit windy, a bit wind swept, I had to put my hood on. I thought it was going to be warm. I said it was warm earlier. It might start to rain as well. I'm enjoying it though. Even though I don't drive in real life, I'm actually enjoying this. Might have to move to the lakes and just drive a boat instead. Ruben criticising my driving and I haven't even had a single lesson. With Ruben back behind the wheel, I thought I'd chill out with my mum. Take in the scenery. Well, this has been fun. It'd be a little bit better though if you get some Prosecco and a few snacks. Which would be quite a good thing for a picnic, but um, no, I've enjoyed it. I I'd enjoyed it. Having a little bit of the drive was all right, but it is pretty slow. It's a pretty slow boat. Well, that was it for the boat. Didn't trust myself to park the boat without a driver's license. Well, that was fun. Did you enjoy that one? Yeah, I did. Awesome stuff. After driving the boat, I thought I'd get some vegan ice cream. Then headed to the souvenir shop and got some chocolate mint cake rum and also some toffee apple vodka, which I tried when I got home. It was beautiful. I tell you what, the weather here in the lakes cannot decide what it wants to do. I've been in my jacket, been in my coat, been in my t-shirt. Well, despite the weather not knowing what to do, it was now time to make a pit stop. We went to this bar that Ruben recommended, got some chips and I got myself a Camden Hells. It reached the evening. And after spending about half an hour trying to find somewhere to eat, we quickly realised that Windermere wasn't going to offer any vegan options. So I think the hardest bit about being vegan is actually trying to find somewhere to eat. Because a lot of places, it's not their fault. Obviously when like I was eating meat and stuff, you could like go to places really easily and get stuff. But like obviously they don't care for everyone, do they? So after walking around for ages, we settled for the sweet potato curry. Oh, it's definitely a lovely town, Windermere. It's so posh and everything, it's really nice. It's got that really country vibes, which is really nice. But no, I've had a really good time so far. That was the end of day one. Day two, we didn't film too much, but we went to the escape rooms. We ended up losing, but we had a great time. The final day, decided to get some breakfast at the Park Dean. It was lovely. Well, we're gonna go axe throwing, but we're kind of in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> like literally, there's nothing here apart from Obviously the axe throwing and the archery. Toilets are even in the shed. <laughs> Never been axe throwing before, so this should be fun. Always wanted to do it, to be fair. So we went to the escape room yesterday. 
didn't really want to record it because obviously you're not really meant to because it will reveal everything and you don't want to give it away um but yeah that was really good we did actually win though we got towards the end almost got through but we were stuck on one puzzle what just took forever Well done. You're on my big competition at the moment, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> Mom, if you tell me not to vlog something, I'm gonna vlog it. I absolutely loved axe throwing. Not gonna humiliate everyone with the scores, but I was the winner. So how was that for you, Mum? Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I enjoyed it. it wasn't any good at it, but I enjoyed it. <laughs> <laughs> everyone loves a try, eh? Gotta say, I've really enjoyed this trip actually. I haven't been to the Lake District in a long time. And if I was to go there, I would definitely go to Windermere. Windermere's been class. Loved staying at the Park Dean as well. It's like nice and simple. I haven't got entertainment on and things. It's just nice and simple. You stay here, have your bed, cook your food and go. Next ball, we went, obviously went to axe throwing. Hired a boat as well. That was awesome. But yeah, great time, great time. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And if you want to see some more trips, let me know in the comments which one you want to see.